Well, last week, this gentleman here had a wicked car with him. He had his Porsche with him, which we thought was a pretty wild car, until he shows up today. Not only does he have a race-ready Pantera, all polished and chromed out, but he wasn't satisfied with that. He had to put nitrous on it. So let's find out just how crazy this guy gets with his car. Now, sir, yes. let me ask you. Why did you feel the need to put nitrous on an already fast car? Actually, didn't feel the need. Uh, the uh, vehicle, actually, I purchased the vehicle that way. It's a 1973 Pantera. It has a 351 Cleveland five-speed transmission. And the nitrous is all on there. It's all work, all working, but there's no nitrous in the tanks. So uh, it's uh, one of those things where the insurance company said no, and uh, there's none in it. So it's, it's more or less for show now, but it would work if you were to fill it. Did you uh, do any of the polishing and all this? I've done a lot of the polishing, but the actual the car actually came this way, but I've had to maintain it. It's a lot of work. I bet it's a lot of work. But it's a fun car to drive. It's my son's favorite car. Do you have any idea how many uh, horsepower you're getting out of that without the nitrous? I would imagine, I would guess somewhere in the horse. Probably around four. Or five. So like seven with the nitrous uh, it Possibly, yeah. Well, I think I think it adds about 150 horsepower to that. Right? It looks like it's going 80 when it's parked. Yeah. I suppose you're right. Yeah, it's very very nice. And all of the uh, all of the inside apron and all the panel work and everything here, this is all ready. It was. Uh, it came from a, uh, a gentleman that built hot rods in uh, Simi Valley area about 25 years ago. So he, it's an older restoration and it's an older. Older school type of uh, car, but it's a really good car, solid car. How did you come across it? Um, it was it was through a uh, actually through a uh, in, what is it? Uh, it was a seizure for uh, tax fraud or something of that nature. And it was uh, the guy they took all his cars and they were up for auction and we were at the auction and that's how it happened. That's a, yeah, what a fun. Yeah. And uh, I noticed there's some. Trick suspension uh, work that's been done here. Do you know anything about that? It's actually, um, I think it's mainly just more cosmetic. The the suspension was there originally, but somebody took the time to either put chrome on it or aluminum, you know, they put billet aluminum pieces or something of that nature to make it stand out a little more. But a lot of it is uh, just glorified. It's a very wild. Car. Yeah, it is wild. It's fun to drive. I bet it is. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure you have to spend four hours a day cleaning it. No, I spent about an hour and a half last night, so. Well, thanks for bringing it today. Absolutely. Once again, another crazy car.